We're on a breakneck type of tempo, and it will wear down the defense. So Lewis Brown standing at about the 25-yard line, and back to the 20, he'll have a return. And Brown, good return. And Brown's got the edge. And Brown will not be cut. He starts high-stepping, and he's into the end zone. Oh, my. 80-yard punt return. There's, there's a number of Nevada transfers on this team. First down again, Shield, Van Shield, and Van Shield for the touchdown. And that will fix your running woes in a hurry. <laughs> Just like that. I'll tell you what, Co Coach Norvell talked about They need the 15-yard line. And again, oh, Booth found a hole, and Booth finds the end zone. But guess what? There's a hanky back at the 22. Let's check. First quarter completely dominated by Colorado State. Cooper Lagasse stands in, firing to the corner for Royals, and Royals goes and gets it for a touchdown. Backed up at the yeah. line of scrimmage, no linebackers. All right, Lagasse, oh, here's that play again, and he's got it again. And how about that? Perel Vaughn dives into the end zone. Got a throw, steps up, downfield open, caught, and a Royals touchdown again. 51 yards. It's inside the 20 yard line. Lega looking, corner. What a catch! Unbelievable grab for Micah Davis and another Aggie touchdown. That makes it easy on them. So they're first and 10, just outside the 10-yard line. <clears throat> and Kobe Johnson. Kobe Johnson trying to get the pylon. He dives and touches it. Refs can <laughs> check with each other, and it's a touchdown. Steven caught Sandley, and, and it was good to see him at least waving at the crowd. And just like that, back they come with Booth. And Booth on the next play scores the touchdown. 48 yards, wow.